Good morning, Year One, and I hope you're ready for another Maths Lessons Day. You have been doing lots of work on your number bonds, and today we're going to do some more work on our number bonds. But let's see if we can remember some of our previous learning. I'm going to share my screen with you, and let's see. Can you tell me what one more than 19 is? What is one more than 19? 16 plus something equals 20. What is that something? And how many dots are there? 6 plus 2 and 3 plus 5 are number bonds. But which are they a number bond to? What number? 6 plus 2 and 3 plus 5. They're number bonds to a number, but what number? I'm going to give you three minutes to have a go. Put me on pause and have a go. Good luck. Fantastic. Let's see how we got on. One more than 19 is 20. 16 plus something is 20. 16 plus 4 is 20. Fantastic. And this one was a big number. You counted all those dots and there was 19. Very good. And these two equations both were the same. They both came to 8 because they were the number bonds to 8. Great job, guys. Now, today we're using our ones to find some of our number bonds okay so we're going to be using our number bonds to add more difficult numbers are you ready now for today you're going to need a pencil a pen and you might need some things to help you with adding miss bamford's got cubes today you could use pasta you could use anything that you can find in your house okay fantastic Let's look at some of our number bonds. 4 plus 3 equals 6 plus 1 equals 7 plus 0 equals. I'm going to have a go at making those. 4 plus three, four, and three together makes seven. And you can double check that by counting. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So that equation makes seven. My next equation is six plus one. One, two, three, four, five, six, plus one, six, seven. Six plus one is seven. Hmm, I wonder what our number bond is. My last equation is seven plus zero. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And I don't add anything there because it's zero. Seven plus zero is Seven. So I was finding the number bond to seven. Okay. These all make seven. And I can use that to help me with my next equation. Because if I know four plus three is seven, I can solve a different equation. I can find out what 14 plus three is. So let's have a go. I've got 14 plus 3. The first thing I need to do is write my equation. 14 plus 3 equals. Now the important part of my equation is these two numbers. Okay? First off, I'm going to make my 14. I've got my 10 already. I'm going to make my 14. 1, 2, 3, 4. I'm adding 3. 1, 2, 
three. Together, I have 14 plus three. But there's a very quick way to solve this. Because if I hide my 10, I have four plus three, which we already know is seven. So all we need to do is add our 10. So if I put my 10 in first, and then I'm adding my ones, there is four plus three, four, five, six, seven. So 14 plus three is 17, just like four plus three was seven. Fantastic. Let's see if we can do this with a different sum. So, we know that two and five make what? What do we know that two and five make? Two and five make seven. We add two to five and we get seven. What if I wanted to know what 2 add 15 was? Hmm. 2 add 15. I'm going to write my sum down. 2 plus 15. Now, the important numbers again are these two. So I'm going to put those numbers in. I've got my 2. And I want to add my 15. I've already got my 10 here, so I'm going to add my 5, my 1s. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Now I have 15 and I have 2. OK? And I can solve this because the first thing I need to double check is these numbers. I've got five and I've got two and I know that they make seven. So when I add my ten first, I'm going to add my ten, I should have ten and this I can count on. So I've got ten we know this goes to 15. We can double check. 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17. And we know that's right because we knew 2 plus 5 was 7. Fantastic. So 2 plus 15 is 17. New number. This time, I have six plus one. I want you to think about what this number bond is. I'm going to give you five seconds. Five, four, three, two, one. Exactly, it's the number bond to seven. So, because we know that, we can now solve the rest of our equation. Because we can find out what 16 plus 1 is. Now we're going to do this together. The first thing I want you to do is write your equation. I'm going to write mine. Off you go. Write your equation. 16 plus 1. Great job. Now we're going to try and make the sum. So, watching me, let's do it at the same time. I've got 16 and 1. We're making 16 first. Remember our important numbers. Okay? We're going to make 16 first. I've already made my 10. I'm going to give you 30 seconds to make your 10. Put me on pause if you need to. Brilliant. 
Now I'm going to finish off and make my 16. 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. Have I got 16? Yes, I do. Brilliant. Now I'm adding my one. So I'm going to add my one here. Thank you. It needs to be in the grid. Great job. 16 plus one. Fantastic. I know that this and this, I'm going to write 71 because I know this is, oh, I got ahead of myself. Thank you. I need to write my tens first, otherwise I might get the number the wrong way round. Thank you for reminding me. I need to write my tens first. So I put my tens in first. Now I can add my ones. I'm going to give you a chance to add your ones. Remember, we can count on from 16, 16. Thank you, 17. And we know this is right because we know that six plus one equals seven. Great job, guys. Really well done. Six plus one is 17. So this time, I want you to have a go at these number bonds. You're going to have a look at the number bonds and I want you to see if you can figure out what number bond this is. We've got four plus four, six plus two, five plus three. Hmm. I'm going to give you three minutes. You can put me on pause and have a go. Use your cubes or anything you've got at home to help you or do it in your head. Have a go, off you go. Fantastic, you've had a go. We know that four plus four is eight. Great, and six plus two, eight. So five plus three must be 20. No, very good, it's eight. So we're looking at our number bond to eight. So, my first clue is this. If I have four plus four, it makes eight. Great. So because I know that, I can find out what 14 plus four is. Okay, you're going to have a go. 14 plus four. What is the first thing you need to do? Write your equation. Great. What do you need to do next? Write the first number. Exactly. You need to find the first number, which is 14. Great. And then you're going to add in the four. Brilliant. You're going to add in the four. I'm going to give you a chance to have a go at that all by yourself. And then we're going to come back and see how we've got on. OK, I'm going to give you four minutes. OK, I'm going to have a go too. Off you go. OK, great. Let's see how we both got on. So my equation is 14 plus 4. So I fat written my equation. I found 14 and I found 4. Absolutely right. Thank you. That wasn't 4. That wouldn't give me the correct answer. The two important numbers are the Yes, it's the four and the four. And I know my, that my ones equal eight. Great. And I can put my tens in. So 14 plus four is? Hmm, that doesn't look right. Did I skip a step? Let's try. Hold on. We got 14, we got four, 
You're absolutely right. I need to add my 10 in first. I'm going to add my 10 in first. And now I need to add my ones. I can count on from 14. 14, 15, 16, 17, 18. Brilliant. And we know this is right because we can do 4 plus 4 equals 8. Brilliant job, guys. Really well done. Give yourself a pat on the back for that because 14 plus 4 is absolutely 18. Last one. You're doing this one completely by yourself. Are you ready? Your equation is going to be helped by 6 plus 2. 6 plus 2 is 8. Great. So what is 16 plus 2? 16 plus 2. I'm going to give you three minutes. Put me on pause and have a go. Off you go. Fantastic. Have you had a go? I have two. Let's check. We wrote our equation 16 plus 2. We found 16. We found 2. We added our 10s first. And then we added our 1s. So 16 plus 2 is 18. We use the number bond 6 plus 2 to help us. Brilliant job, guys. So, when you know your number bonds to 10, like 6 plus 4, is 10, you can find your number bonds to 20. Because 16 plus 4 is 20. So your challenge today is going to be looking at some of your number bonds to 20. OK, so you've got a worksheet to do. Remember, use your resources to help you at home. OK, watch the video, pause it if you need to. And lots of hard work from all your days so far, so I know you can do it. OK, superstars. Have fun and if you have any questions, pause the video, rewind it, double check and remember your number bonds. Your number bonds are going to really help you. OK, see you again tomorrow.